Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel and in this video we are going to solve this error which says something like this NSIS error writing temporary file problem or something like NSIS error make sure your temp folder is valid. So let's solve this and without wasting any time let's get started. So first of all guys you need to restart your computer sometimes after restarting the problem should resolve on its own otherwise you can just re uh, use the installer to install the software again and you can also do some adjustments in the temp folder so let's see some solutions i'll go to the start menu and write percentage sign write temp and then percentage sign again hit enter and then it will move to the temporary folder and here you can just select all the files and just delete all of these right here so hit enter and if it asks you to do the same for all the files you can just continue with that and some of the files will still not delete because it is used by another application. So just skip that part and let's see if other ones you can delete and let's skip the part that you can't delete and just continue with it. And then after the deletion is done, what you can do is just open the services from here. Go to the start menu and right here services. Hit enter. Just make it full screen and just search for Windows Insider service. So let's write W here. And it will take you to the Windows Insider Services right here. Just double click here. And then I can just change the starter type to manual if it is set to automatic or disabled. So just set it to manual. And if the service state is stopped like this, you can just click on start here. It will take some time to start and then stop it and then start it one more time. What it will do is it will restart the services. And then you can click on apply and OK and just close this. And what more thing what we can try here is go to the start menu again, write CMD and run it as administrator and just play it. And now let's write here SFC, give a space, write forward slash here and write here scan now. Make sure the spellings are correct and it will begin the system scan. This will take some time. So just relax until it completes that. And once this is done, you can just close this and then just restart your computer and that should solve the problem. So let's restart this. And there you go. Hopefully guys, this problem will be resolved after all of this. Let me know in comments what works for you and I will see you in the next one.